Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge, and we will be underway. The teams then, Olympiakos against Benfica. This is Peter Drury, and I'm happy to inform you that Jim Beglin has joined me to offer his expertise. Glad to be here, Peter, and I'm ready to rumble. Starting lineups. Away. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Julio Cesar's the man. Just keep an eye out for his kicking and general distribution. It's seriously good, and he can get his team on the front. And it's a goal! And some of the best managers I played for insisted on starting games as you mean to go on. And we've just seen a very important opening goal from an extremely talented individual who looks primed for more. He really does look at it. Oh, that was a close call, but for me, he timed his run to absolute perfection there to stay just onside, and he's still a lot to do, you know, but I think he's tucked that away really well. Benfica trail at this early stage, how will they respond? Gets it back. Salvio. Let's Brown a day. Ide Brown can't hurt you with his back to goal and I think if they can keep him facing in that direction then the only thing he can do really is to just lay the ball off and, and he's not really going to cause much trouble if he continues doing that so I think they're defending him very very well Olympiakos scoring in the first 10 minutes to make it 1-0 and it's shown us Looking for options. Tries a through ball. Round the day, looking to penetrate opposition lines. Played out to the right. Still going, where to next? He's dealt with that well. He's going to have to tune his rangefinder before the next one. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Grounded D with a shot! Well, he would surely have scored there more times than not. The Troglu with a delicate ball. 
that's the goalkeepers to claim. Passes it through. goes for half time. Well they showed glimpses of some wonderful football to go in with the lead at half time and that's definitely pleased the fans. I think they'll be looking to keep this intensity up now in the second half. Olympiakos yeah, in at half time with a slender one goal lead. Here we go again. Olympiakos Carry a one-goal lead into the second half. Selvia. Luisao. Selvia. Eliseu. Cuts it out. Olympiakos ahead here by what is still the only goal. Eliseu as well there, alert. Salvia. Almost an hour gone. Olympiakos need to make a change here. Benfica going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. They really are proving themselves to be solid all over the field. The ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. The question, that's a foul. Burisau. And a save. it in gently here it is now surely so close to drawing level well he was so eager to score there he almost put too much into that attempt to equalize what a waste Subtlety, he's launched himself there. Now the pass. Brown it in. Can he find a finish now? Oh, and that should have been two. What a huge let off that was. Conceding them would really have left the momentum to climb. Come loose and the chase is on. A good hand from the keeper. Decent clearance now. Can anyone get on the end of it? I suspect there'll have been a few nails chewed off during that attack. How they survived, I'm not quite so sure. But their lead is intact, and that's all that matters. The well, time is running out. They need to get the ball upfield. Who's 
ball. Who's going to get there? Looks to slip it through. And that is that. What a game. End to end, it flew by, and in the end, it all came down to just the odd goal. Look, it's a very fine win, but for me, the defence has been terrific in holding on to that lead. Well, that's it from us. Thanks very much, Jim. It's a very good day to you from both of us.